Hello everyone, my name is Alan from Al's Basketball Training and today I am going to show you guys my top 5 3 on 3 basketball plays that anybody can use if you're playing in a 3 on 3 basketball game. Hey coaches and players, how do you like this shirt? Link in the description. Hello everyone, so if you're new to this channel, my name is Alan, and basically on this channel I show you basketball plays, drills, and skills. So if you like that stuff, hit that like button and subscribe, because, well, I post these videos every single day. But anyways, today I am going to show you my top 5 3 on 3 basketball plays that you can use today with your team. So let's get down to the clipboard and let me show you my top five three on three plays that you can use. So in this first play, what we're going to have is player one passing over to player three and he's going to screen away for player two. At this time, player two, depending on how the defense plays, could run and receive a pass here. He could also cut towards the rim. Now, if he, if he cuts over here and he receives the ball, the next thing that's going to happen is player 3 is going to cut towards the rim, back out, back screen for player 1 who's going to do the same thing and back out. However, if player 2 was to pass to the, one of those two sides and screens away, and that player who he's screening for cuts towards the rim, what has to happen now is player 3 can either pass him the ball for the layup, or player 3 can then, at the well at least player 3 in this in this case, will dribble up to the top of the of the key to the point and player one will then follow through and head out to that three point line. Now let's get on to the second play. In this second play, same idea. So player three is going to then pass over to player two or to player one. But for sake of argument, let's say he passes over to player two. He will then, instead of screening away, what he's going to do is screen for player two and this will be a screen and roll. When he's rolling towards the basket, he can get hit up for a pass. If not, he's going to continue through. He is then going to screen for player one who's going to cut towards the rim. And then he can pop back out and you're back in the same formation. So that now he can, you can run the same play either here or the one I showed you last. Where he, instead of screening for, he could screen away. These two plays work hand in hand together for one because they're easy, but for two, they set back up to the exact style as you were in before so you can continue to run the same two plays back to back. Now in this third three on three basketball play, what we're going to have is now player three in the post and player one in the post. It doesn't have to be your smallest player and tallest player. It does not have to be like that. It could be anybody. But one of these players is going to go and screen across for the other post player who is then going to pop up. And then instead of popping up for the three-point shot, he's going to go and screen for the player who has the ball. The player who was originally doing the screening, he's going to pop up to the three-point line. This is going to be a screen and roll so that now he can go in for a layup. He could pass to player one for the layup or mid-range shot. Or he could pass way out to player three if his defender really sagged down to play help defense. Or what could happen as well as player 2 could pass to 1 who could then pass the 3 for the 3 point shot as well. If he is shooting the 3 point shot you already have 2 players ready for the rebound anyways. So that just sets up a nice easy rebound layup possibly if that becomes a possibility. Now in this 4th play this is almost like a horns basketball play. What we're going to have is one of these 2 players they're going to pop out to the 3 point line where player 1 will pass them the ball. And now you're going to have the other post player. He is going to go and back screen for player one, who is then going to cut towards the rim and may be open for a pass. If he's not open, player two may be open, popping up to the three-point line, depending on if his defender went down, as well as his player one's own defender went down to play defense as well. You may have a player two who's wide open for a three-point shot. Now in our fifth and final three on three basketball play that I really love to run is now player two is screening down for player three. Player three is going to use that screen and he's going to go and screen for player one and then player two is going to pop out to this three point line and now what you're going to have is player one using three as a screen 
three is going to roll towards the basket and now depending on where the defense is if player two's man plays help defense he may be open for a layup or for a three-point shot or player one could go in for a layup or player one could also pass to player three for the layup as well now i hope these are not necessarily advanced basketball plays, but kind of mediocre basketball plays that you can run with your three-on-three -three basketball team. Later on, pretty soon, I will be releasing some of my top five three-on-three -three plays for younger kids and three-on-three -three basketball plays for more advanced basketball players as well. So stay tuned for those two videos coming up within about a month over the next maybe let's say three two to three weeks those videos will be coming out as well so stay tuned but anyways i hope you have enjoyed today's video if you have hit that like button and subscribe if you know any coaches that may like basketball plays uh well daily let them know about my channel and uh yeah i will see you guys tomorrow because i will be posting again tomorrow as i do this stuff every single day so i will see you guys tomorrow Oh, oh, and wait, guess what? I forgot today's daily question. Do you play three-on-three -three basketball or do you coach three-on-three -three basketball? Let me know in the comments below. Hello, basketball coaches. So yes, this is a quick few second advertisement. Basically, I just wanna let you guys know that I have another channel called Football Coach Allen. I go over football plays. I am starting to add more and more plays on there. So if you are a football coach as well as a basketball coach, go check that out. You can see it in the link in the description below, but you can also see it as my other channels on the right side of my main YouTube channel, Basketball Coach Allen. So I will see you guys over there, hopefully. Hello, so if you have liked this video, click over here to subscribe. Or maybe over here, depending on which side I put it on. I don't know yet. Anyways, uh, also the opposite direction or the opposite side is another video you may like. So I hope to see you again in one of those next videos. Yeah.